Hey guys and welcome to Travel with Tay. Today we'll be talking about the topic of which backpack you need to travel. There are thousands of backpacks out these days that you can see in the market. Simply go on eBay, Amazon, wherever, and you can find hundreds and thousands of these bags. Now it's, it's the matter of fact of finding which one is the most suitable for you and which one will help you travel the most efficient and easy. Now, I've been traveling for a good seven, eight years or so, so I've got a pretty good idea of what I want, what I take, and what kind of bag that I need. So today we'll be talking about a backpack that has most of the accessories I like and the features that I love. So, without further ado, let me introduce to you this one. Uh... Where did this come from? Oh, sorry guys, I've always really wanted to do that. Hopefully it'll turn out not as bad as what I think it does. Anyway, this is the Osprey 5.70 litre backpack. Backpack. And so I just received this uh, recently in the mail. Give you a good look of it. No, it's, it's, a, it's a nice bag. Um, the colour is volcanic grey and it comes in medium and large size. So, I've done a lot of research about these bags, and uh, as I said before, there are a lot of bags on the market. But this one, I love, and today I'll explain to you why it is good. First off, looking at it, it's, it's alright, it's a nice design, pretty sleek. Um, hopefully you can see it, pretty sleek. In the back, and you're thinking, hold on, this is not a bloody backpack, where are, are the straps? Straps, man! Uh, but that straps, you don't really call it a backpack, you can call it a pack, a carry pack, with the handles. It's got two handles, this bag's got two handles, lots of um, bolts here, and I like how it's very compact. Now the bag itself is 55 litres, and at the front here you have a day pack. This is what I love about this bag, is that it comes with... A little hidden gem, like the Aladdin, like the genie. Rob, 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 give me three wishes. Give me three wishes. Well, first of all, let's look at the exterior of this bag. Uh, as you can see, we have the handle here, and we have the handle here. And so it's nice to carry. I don't know if you want to show off your biceps, which I have none, because my Asian genetics doesn't allow me to get massive without steroids. Anyway, the straps are hidden nicely behind this zipper here. This is a really clever design. As we can see, we'll open that up. And voila, open sesame. We have straps. Straps, straps, straps galore. And you also got your waist straps here. For the extra support and to be nimble and to look professional when you're traveling, you want to look professional with these around your hips. And they do add a bonus to distributing the weight and looking after your back. Anywho, first off you look at it, it looks pretty messy. You're like, what do, what do I do with this flap here, you know? Easy solution is that you roll it up. Now, let's roll it. Now, let's roll this thing. And... It just, and it magically hooks away underneath. It's gone. It is gone. Gone like my ex-girlfriends. Now you have this nice backpack. It fits pretty snug. It's got nice pads on your shoulders so you don't, you know, you don't rub into your bones and sort of ruin your, you know, ruin your, your, your arms. So it's got nice pads that sort of stay really firm, uh, quite padded, as I said before, and they're really nice, you know? And you got these waist ones as well. Uh, ooh, let's see if I can feel... Yeah! 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 So I feel really nice and snug and secure. So I really like this backpack. Now the reason why they have this cover case on the bottom is so when you're traveling on the airplanes your straps 
don't get caught. So let's put this back up. Roll that out. Anyway, simply, simply fold these together. Make sure they're medium rare. I'm sorry, I just feel like there's a cooking show. Roll up your pancake. And all you need to do is zip it up. If I can find the zip, of course. Uh, this is um, easier than it looks. You know, when you're, when you're at the airport, you have so much time. You have hours. So it's easy like that. You know, you, you roll it up. And push in the little bits of fat, just like I do into my pants. And voila! You have a carry case. Now, the reason why they do this is at the airports, when you check in your bag, the worst thing that can happen is when you go reach your destination, you've been on a 16 hour flight and you sat next to two big blokes and they're just sweating all over you and you've had a really crap flight and the air hostess gave you some gassy food. Anyway, you, you land and you pick up your bag and you're thinking, oh crap, I've lost the strap. So you know what happens? It gets caught and it goes rip. And then what? You're bagless. What makes a travel without a bag? A travel, a bagless traveler. Now, that doesn't really work because you need a bag for your clothes and for all sorts of things. With this, you're never going to get your straps caught on into anything, you know? You, you're not going to really lose it. It's just going to rub nice and gently into other bags and say, Hello, how you doing? I want to be a world traveler just like you guys want. Now, the other reasons why I like this bag is that it zips open. So, let's just undo these. Oh, oh, sorry. So, say. And undo this. Um, it feels like I'm, I'm doing bras, which I have no idea of how to do. You just unzip your bag all the way through. It's a bit, you know what, it's a lot easier when it's full of things. Yeah, right now it's just really flappy because there's nothing in there. But once you have clothes, and 50 kilograms of cocaine, that's when it's sort of... Anyway, look, oh, be beautiful interior, all right? Beautiful interior, nice and green. Green is for go, red is for don't go. Um, so you can do, you can open a little strap here, put whatever you like. And inside here, you have a, you have a lot of space, okay? Now, I don't travel heavy, I travel light, if that makes sense means I don't take much with me. It maximizes the chance of me escaping a lion or a tiger chasing me in the wild. Which will never happen. Fingers crossed. And so, as you can see, it's a beautiful bag inside. I mean, if you want to take a lot, I probably suggest the 90 liter. That's a lot. 90 liters, you could shower with if it was in water. But the real beauty of this thing is that it opens like this. Now, I've seen a lot of backpacks, well, most of the backpacks, they open from the top, you know, you, they, they open from the top, you gotta sort of unroll it, and do all this crap. And, I don't know, it looks like you're mixing dough. It looks like you're kneading dough on the top of your bag. Anyway, you open up your bag and, and it's hard, right? I mean, let's say I soil my pants when I'm traveling, right? You know, and I've got this nasty stain on my pants and all I want to get is some fresh undies. Because man, they make your travels. Anyways, if you got this original backpack, you're going to be like digging deep. Like, oh my god, where are my undies? By the time you're like bending over and everything, your, your stains are going to spread around your cheeks. And uh, Anyway, so with this one, open it easy, get what you need, get in and out, in and out. So guys, this is a 70 liter bag. It means you can put 70 liters worth of things inside. 70 kilograms, a, a liter a kilogram. Yeah, mathematics, that's my Asian genetics. Now the, the thing is, it's not, it's 70 altogether. You have your backpack here, which is 55 liters. And then you got this baby boy here in front. Now I love this because during the day, I like to take my cameras out. I like to take my tourist things out, you know, water, 
So I like to take things out and look at this. Let's just open this baby up and hello there. There is another bag. Now it's simple to take this one out. What you gotta do, find a zip down here. And the clever thing is they think about everything. There's a little clip down here that clips onto this bag as well. So you just unclip that tiny little cutie. Look how cute that is. Alright, and you just go. So, do you really get two bags for the price of one? Yes, you do. Okay, and you have your mini day pack here. All right, so this is your 15 liter day pack. Day pack. Cleverly designed, very cleverly put together. Um, that they're strapped together like this. All you've got to do is undo these straps. Uh, nice little bag. But your yeah, Osprey logo, your Fast Eagle. Green for go. So, I have hoped you like my review of the Osprey 5.70 liter. Just letting you guys know, FYI, I haven't been paid to do this. I just really, I just really love showing that a product that I really believe in. I leave on my next journey very soon, so keep following me. If you like my video, please subscribe and follow me on my journey as I travel. So next time I'll be talking about what to put in this bag when you're traveling. To travel light and only, and only needing the essentials. Okay, thank you, arigato. I will see you soon, ciao, bye. Bye.